is you can't really tell but like look at my sunburn it is so bad Hey guys, what's up? Danielle here and I am back with another video. So for today, I wanted to surprise you guys with a get ready with me 4th of July edition because today is the 4th of July and I tried something new obviously and I'm wearing something really crazy, obviously. Um, yeah, so we're having a party at my house so I just thought well, why not go full out and enjoy the day, you know? Yeah. Alright, so without further ado, let's dive right into this video. Hey guys, so the first thing I'm going to be doing is pulling my hair back so everything's out of my face. Now I'm using the Urban Decay Eyeshadow Primer Potion in Original and priming my eyelids. I'm using my Laura Mercier Translucent Loose Setting Powder and putting it on top of my eyelids so that nothing creases. Now, I'm using my Morphe and Jaclyn Hill palette, which I am in love with, and I'm using the shade Twerk, and putting it all in the outer corner, outer V, making a nice V shape, and it's a nice, really pigmented blue, and I'm just going to put it in there so that I can have the blue for the red, white, and blue. Now, I'm just picking up my blending brush and blending it all in. The next palette I'm using is the Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette, and I'm using the shade Venetian Red and going in to the inner corner with it and a little bit into the center of the eyelid, making sure I leave room for the shimmer. Now I'm just picking up my blending brush and blending it all in. This palette I'm using today is the Too Faced Natural Love Palette and I'm using the shade Poodle and applying it with my finger all to the center of my eyelid. Now I'm going back into all of my palettes and touching up whatever I feel needs to be touched up, adjusting the eyeshadow to the way I want it. Now I'm using my Rimmel London Scandal Eyes Precision Micro Eyeliner Black and just putting on some eyeliner and this time I actually attempted a wing. I know it's not the greatest. I'm working on it guys, I promise. I've been practicing a lot, but I'm just going to apply my eyeliner and yeah, make a nice thin line so you can definitely make sure you can see the red, white, and blue. I'm going back into the Jaclyn Hill palette and using the shade Twerk and applying it to my lower lash line. Now I'm using my lovely eyelash curler and curling my eyelashes, holding each one for about 10 seconds each. Now I'm using my Ulta Waterproofed Amped Lashes Mascara and I'm pretty sure the color is black brown and I'm just applying it to my eyelashes, both up and bottom lash line, making sure I just make those lashes long because I really like my eyelashes when they're long. Who doesn't? But I'm using waterproof just because I do have a pool, so I don't want it to run off while swimming. Now, I finished with my eyes, and this is the final eye look. Now, I'm using my Ulta Professional Flawless Primer, 
and it's green to take away the redness because I am sunburned. So I'm just going to apply it all over my face. Now I'm using my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade 10 or light. And I'm just applying it to all the necessary areas that I feel need to be covered. Now, I'm just going to be blending it all in with my beauty blender. Now I'm taking my translucent powder and just setting my face. Now I'm taking my Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush in the shade Parte and applying it to my cheekbones. Now I'm taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Nicole Giraro Glow Kit and I'm using the shade Forever Lit and applying it to the inner corner. Now I'm taking the highlight called Kitty Cat and I'm just applying it to my... I still forgot what it was called. I'm sorry, guys. I'll promise next time I'll remember. But I'm just applying it and making sure my highlight is nice and uh, popping. Because who doesn't want a popping highlight? I mean, am I right? Also, I'm going to apply it to the bridge of my nose and on my Cupid's bow. Now I'm taking my Baby Lips sunscreen and applying it all over. And then I'm going to be taking my Bare Minerals Papa Passion in the shade Rose Passion and applying it all over my lips. Now I'm just setting my face with my setting spray. This is the final face look. Second to last step to getting ready with me is making sure my hair is done. So I'm just going to put my hair and part it into different sections and then curl my hair with a Beach Waver S1. And we're gonna go super fast through this. Once I'm done curling my hair, I'm going to go and change and put on my outfit. And that's all I have. Thanks for getting ready with me. video i hope you guys all enjoyed it tell me what you think of it i want to hear back from you guys in the comments down below but yeah 
So I have no idea, to be completely honest, when I'm uploading this video. I think I just want to kind of upload this as soon as possible. So yeah. Alright. Hope you guys are good with that plan. Better be because I'm going to do what I want. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so I love you guys all so, so, so much. Give this video a big thumbs up. Leave a comment down below. Follow me on all my social media. Um, to get more of me, see more of me, get updates, you know. You feel me? So yeah. Alright, I love you guys all so much. Be sure to subscribe for future videos. And I post every other Friday. So yeah. Alright, I love you guys.